Hey, what up, y'all? Mr. Cruz here, your friendly neighborhood producer, back with another video. And in today's video, I'm going to teach you guys all about quantizing. Let's go. So quantizing is just like a fancy word that means like um, kind of organizing or structuring things so that they don't sound offbeat. But essentially, all it really means is you see these like white lines in between these notes here. That means that it's going to snap it to that line. So if I had a note that was hitting somewhere in the middle, it'll automatically snap it to the closest line or snap it to the to the grid so that it's in rhythm with whatever the tempo is. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that right here. So first up, you either want to have an instrument a um so that'd be the virtual instrument the drum machine or the sampler selected it's not going to do it for voice and it's not going to do it for like the guitar and the bass because those are live instruments with those you can kind of do this so i'm going to stretch this uh region out so that it's right there actually let me also make sure that um it's set to snap to grid yes with my playhead all the way at the beginning i'm going to hit record then i'm going to play a little something um, i'm going to try to intentionally play it off so that i can show you guys how the quantizing works but who knows how well it'll go because you know i'm so perfect all right let's go All right, not a whole lot there. I just needed a little bit to be able to mess around with here. All right, so we can kind of see here that a lot of the notes that I hit are not on the grid and I want them to be on the grid. So this means that I kind of played it off beat, not necessarily off beat, it's just like with human imperfections. Um, so I'm gonna select whatever notes I want to uh, quantize. So let's say I wanted these three to be quantized. Here is where I would select whatever the resolution is. Now, I don't want to describe what the resolution is. I'll save that for another video, but I want to select the resolution that's going to be best suited to whatever rhythm I'm playing in. In this case, I think if I get it to one eighth, I should be good. And once I have that, I'm going to select quantize and boom, it's going to snap it to the grid. If I can zoom out a little bit more, I should be able to select all of them, hit control A to select all, hit quantize. And now the only problem that I see is probably this area right here. So let's see if we can move this over one um, and move this one over one as well. All right, now let's see. There you guys go, that's how you quantize. Also, there's another quick way that you can kind of do this is by right clicking on the MIDI region itself and then selecting quantize and then let's say one eighth and then I get my one eighth resolution. You can do that as well, much quicker. Well, that's what I got for you guys. Let me know in the comments below if this is gonna help you guys out. Also, if you feel like you learned something in this video, hit that like button for me. If you wanna check out some more of my other band lab videos, click right here. Outside of that, it's your boy, Mr. Cruz, out.